What's going on guys? I'm here to bring you today a review of the uh, WWE Network and uh, yeah I couldn't get it to work on my 360 yet I, there's still issues with that so I went ahead and bought an Apple TV uh, yesterday so $99 and it came with a $25 iTunes gift card so that was pretty good I have been eyeballing one of them for a while now so I went what the heck you know this thing might <laughs> who knows when it's gonna work they say Monday but we'll see probably it will work when the Xbox one app comes out you know during the summer I don't know so I went ahead and bought it and last night I uh, you know was playing with it for a little bit watch a couple of shows I just got done watching a couple of shows too so here's a little overview of it of you know how it looks like on the Apple TV and whatnot so here it is guys the WWE Network so you got here the recommended stuff the only thing that I don't like is that you let's say if you start watching a show and you decide to for some reason you know get out of it you just can't go back to it and resume it from you know f from where you last were watching it so that's the only problem that I have with so you got here you know the schedule of like you know what what they're showing today and whatnot right now they're doing WrestleMania 25 here are the shows so the pay-per-views the Raw SmackDown replays main event NXT and superstars the countdown WrestleMania rewind and beyond the ring and here are some vault shows I, I really like this one's uh, the legends of wrestling the round tables so I wish they could put you know some more cuz I I know there's a bunch of them right now we only got four but they're really really good some stuff for, for WCCW and ECW so here's the meat and potatoes of the WWE Network and that's the WWE pay-per-view CCW and WCW so you you're getting all the pay-per-views pretty much I've watched a couple and they so far they look really good I know they just added uh, the Royal Rumble on Friday I believe so I, I bought it on Friday on I bought it on Blu-ray from Best Buy and then I I got home and I read online that it was already on on the WWE app so I went ahead and just you know returned it so you pretty much got all the stuff here 86 85 so you, you know pretty good stuff here So yeah guys, uh, this is the only thing that I don't like, so if you start watching the show, so let's start with this one. If you go back for whatever reason, like I exited it out the other day, um, yesterday, and uh, when I went back to it, I couldn't go back to where I was and I was like over half, you know, over halfway done. And I just couldn't go back to it. I had to re pretty much fast forward. So, so the quality it's pretty good. It's really good. So like, here's the thing. Right now, instead of like going back to it where I was, I have to go back to says from start. There's no like resume or anything. That's the only downsides of it, but other than that, I'm I'm really enjoying it. And for you know, ten dollars a month, sixty dollars every six months, or however you, you know, however it is, it's it's a really really good price for everything that you're getting. So yeah, I know this week after the trial, the free one week trial is over. They're gonna be adding a bunch of other stuff. 
so can't wait for that. So yeah, guys, this is my review for the WWE Network on the uh, Apple TV. Thanks for watching.